Welcome to another episode of Get That Bread, and we're in a car park. It's probably really loud, and you can probably hear like cars driving around and shit, and it's really nerve wracking, like, because people could like be watching us and stuff, but. They are watching. This is cringe. It is so cringe. I realized that I haven't actually ever told anyone what the plan was with this build, so I thought I'd wrangle Woody along, and Adam's off shot over there. So we don't have a script? Yeah, there's no scripts. This no, is all off the cuff. Nothing was provided. It's relatable content. It's organic. <laughs> well, run us through what you've done and what you're gonna do. All right, so for anyone who's new to the channel, this is a 2017 XL PX2 Ranger. So it is the base model Ranger, like this is the lowest spec you can get. Um, so far we have put wheels and a throttle controller on it, and that is it. But yeah, I thought I should tell you guys what the actual plan is. So at the back of the vehicle, it does have a tow bar already. Plan of attack for the channel itself get that bread is is just going to be doing cool shit to cars so this vehicle at some point in time would be a tow vehicle for i don't know a car if we have it stripped down and it's not drivable and we have to take it somewhere this will be the tow rig but it's also my daily driver so um, it's the car that i'll like take camping and off-road in and all that sort of stuff so mm -hmm. a capable off-road car and something that can tow, tow a vehicle yeah and something that's going to get you to work every yeah day. and reliable <laughs> but this thing's got 300,000 kilometers on it, so it's probably not going to last for much long. And then we'll just engine swap it. It's just all content, right? I actually can't even hear what you're saying. It's all content. <laughs> Everything's content. Fuck that Especially that big V8 over there. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Instead of talking in this extremely loud car park, I reckon we go somewhere more quiet and we'll run through what the plan of attack is. All right, where was I? Plan of attack with the Ranger. So let's just go over the whole vehicle and I'll tell you what the plan is. So last episode we chucked wheels on and they poke a little bit, so we definitely need to run some flares, just some slimline ones to cover that poke to keep Queensland police happy. Follow me to the back of the vehicle. The tub. So the tub has seen better days. Now this was an old work ute, but the whole back of the tub here is all dinted. Um, whatever this like clear plastic thing, I don't know what it is, um, is all like crusty and gross looking. So that's gotta, gotta go. There's like little rust surface rough spots all over it. Um, also it has these tie down points on it as well, uh, which is all good if like you're a mad tradie, but I'm not. We'll get one that doesn't have those as well. So it'll make it a bit more sleek looking. Um, does anyone know what the hell this is? Because I don't. Do you, Woody? No. <laughs> Good. Anyway, so we're going to do a tub swap just to another one that doesn't have these on it and not all rusty and everything. Window tint. Fun fact, I did actually try and window tint and the tint I bought from Super Cheap was f***ing terrible. Definitely needed to pay somebody to do a proper window tinting job. If you come inside the vehicle with me, Woody. This is the worst head unit I've ever seen in my life. Not in terms of the fact of like features, but it actually doesn't, you can't see it. So it's the worst head unit ever. You can't actually, it's not usable during the day. Um, so we'll get another one. Um, there's one that actually takes up the whole column in the middle that we'll swap it out for. Steering wheel as well has seen better days. Um, so we'll swap that out as well for a PVS automotive one. Let's go around the front. Let's go, Let's to, go the to the front. business end. Yeah. <laughs> Two Jay-Z, no shit. So we're doing a full engine swap now. <laughs> <laughs> so there's nothing wrong with this motor just yet. Uh, we'll run this thing into the ground. So she's got 300,000 Ks on it, but we are gonna upgrade to a front mount intercooler as well, just to get the stock one up a bit higher, a bit more airflow. Uh, we'll get rid of this light bar that's flapping around as well. Uh, we'll clean the intake as well, because I really wanna take that off and see what that looks like, because I'm sure it's clogged as. Uh, we'll throw a catch can on it. But other than that, I don't think we need to do too much in here. Maybe an airbox and a snorkel to make it go choo-choo when we change gears. So as okay as this bull bar is, uh, it's not going to do too much in an accident because it is alley. So we're going to upgrade to a steel bull bar and we're going to run a winch as well. So this one, this bar can't take a winch at this point in time. 
and we'll swap out this grill for that. You've seen it, seen them on all the ranges, the one that says Ford, um, just to give it a bit of a cool look. But I know what you're asking yourself, and Chris, your suspension is not going to be able to take the weight of a steel bull bar and a winch. Well, the most exciting part of this whole thing is we have a full three inch superior engineering lift kit to go on it as well. So we're talking front shocks, rear shocks, leaf springs, diff drop kit. I don't know what else it comes with, it comes with other stuff, but it's all ready. I already have it in the shed ready to go on. Oh, sliders, should probably protect it. So chuck sliders on. We could get a chain. Actually, if we get an air box, we do have to chain it because these don't like aftermarket air boxes. Oh yeah, camping setup. Mm. So we should chuck a dual battery behind the rear seat. Yeah, so I don't know if we'll do the tub rack, uh, rooftop tent hole we'll get up again. As nice as it is to be up off the ground, it is annoying because you have to pack it up. That's it, that's all I got. If I've, if I've forgotten anything, put it down in the comments. But that is it for this episode of Get That Bread. You guys got anything to add? Get that bread. Man, it's a car coming. <laughs> anyway. They're literally be... parking beside us. Are they? Oh no. This will be in the outtakes. I hope they can't hear that car that just started off over there. Oh, they'll definitely hear that car. Oh my god. Get that bread. Get that microphone. Um, we're in the way of all these people. Yeah, man. You want to park There's, um, we're taking up three car parks. <laughs> There's no car. Hey, mate. How you going? Don't worry, it's just real amateur stuff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are we in the way of a meeting? <laughs> I think so. I think Did ever, was everyone like, let's meet here at three o'clock? Oh, Jesus Christ. Let's do that entire thing again about the f***ing... We zoomed in. Yeah. <laughs>